Hi, this is Galit Gofarb and thank you very much for joining me here today. Today I'm going to be talking about how to reduce chronic stress that leads to weight gain. Now science has proven that stress leads to weight gain in several different ways. And the primary method is through the release of cortisol, which is a stress hormone that is released together with several other hormones during the fight or flight response, which is a reaction that occurs when we're under stress. Now cortisol makes us crave high energy, high fat and sugar rich foods, which in turn lead to weight gain. Now higher stress levels not only make you crave these foods, but they also make you desire more of them as a means of survival. The body wants to make sure it has sufficient energy reserves to support us through the stressful period. And this is the reason that when we're stressed out, we tend to eat more foods as a means to support the higher needs of our body during the stress response. And the effect worsens when we are feeling stress for extended periods of time during chronic stress. And this type of stress poses many different health risks, including weight gain and all of the risks that come along with it. But the consequences of stress are not limited to stress eating. You see, higher amounts of cortisol also tend to reduce metabolism levels, making any weight loss attempts less effective. Stress also reduces the release of digestive juices, making digestion less efficient. And chronic stress also affects how your body stores fat. In most cases, stress leads to more fat stores, especially around the abdominal area. Stress levels also have an indirect effect on your weight because being stressed out usually means that you're very busy as well. And this makes most of us opt for unhealthy fast food and eating outside in general. Now, since most of the food found in these fast food restaurants are incredibly unhealthy, this makes weight gain and other health issues inevitable. A stressful and busy lifestyle also leads one to exercise less or not at all, which is another contributing factor, factor to weight gain. Less sleep, which often comes with stress, also leads to weight gain. So how can we reduce stress or even eliminate stress from our lives? Well, it often seems like stress is something that can't be avoided in the modern world with a busy job, children to care for, and many bills to pay. But thankfully, there are several habits and lifestyle choices which can help you reduce or even eliminate stress from your life completely. Let's look into these few methods of reducing stress. So number one, you want to pay attention to the warning signs of stress. This is the first stage. Most of us don't even realize that we're under high stress until we suffer from burnout. And the signs of stress differ from person to person, but you, they usually include faster breathing, a faster heart rate, a rising feeling of anger, sometimes impatience or anxiety in different people, muscle tension, irritability, and long -term, in, in the long term, insomnia. But once you notice that you are under stress, I recommend deep breathing as a first step. Deep breathing helps activate the parasympathetic nervous system, controlling the relaxation response. When you focus your awareness on your breath, making it slower and deeper, this helps to slow your heart rate and reduce blood pressure, also allowing you to feel more at peace. Now, once you recognize that an event has caused you some stress, Create a quick and straightforward relaxation routine to reduce or remove it, such as this one. Number one, you first decide to let the stress go just as it came, since you are not the stress. It is just a feeling that you feel and it's outside of you, it's not you. So you can choose to dismiss the stressful thoughts and feelings that do not make you feel good. To do this, once you become aware of the stress, Take in a few deep breaths and then see yourself as the observer of the stress. Because this is what you are. You are not the feeling, you are the observer of the feeling. And as the observer, you can consciously choose to let go of the stress. Now, there is never something that should come between you and your happiness. The only way something can come between you and your happiness is if you let this happen. So release the, the stress and the negative feelings and just let them go. Acknowledge that they are there and choose to let them go away. You can't change what has already happened and you don't know for sure what the future holds. 
So you, and you certainly can't change other people uh, to make you feel better. So you might as well let go of these negative feelings and just deal with life as it comes. I know this may seem difficult to do at first, but once you learn to notice the signs of stress and become aware that you are not your feelings or emotions, then you can choose to let them go. And when you learn to do this, there is nothing much that can come between you and your feelings of happiness. Now the next step is to reduce your overall stress levels by making better lifestyle choices. Find the time to enjoy your hobbies, take warm baths, do some stretching exercises, meditation, take a massage or do yoga. Yoga actually enhances mood and has been found to be as effective as antidepressant drugs for the treatment of depression and anxiety. Also, you can listen to music that you like and exercise daily, even lightly, like walking. Exercise lowers cortisol levels in the long run and it also releases endorphins, which help improve your mood also after, long after the exercise period is over. Exercise also improves sleep quality and reducing stress and anxiety. A daily 30 minute walk in nature can reduce stress levels for the whole day. So go out into nature. Also physical intimacy, including hugging, is also great for relieving stress. And to finish off, of course, eat healthy. And try to follow a specific meal plan to ensure that you're consuming enough of the right foods at the right times to support more self-control. This will have a massive effect on your stress levels. Here at The Gorilla Diet, we prepare for you a personalized menu to help you achieve all of your well-being goals. So check it out here. And overall, reducing the stress in your life must be a conscious decision that when you make this decision and you make a few lifestyle alterations to support your peace of mind, you will be healthier and happier and live a more fulfilling, stress-free life. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you wish. And if you want more information on health and weight loss and how to support your well-being, please visit us at thegorilladiet.com. Thank you very much.